for years. <laughs> <laughs> by John David. I have heard uh, more than enough to award you arms this weekend about all of the wonderful things that you do for everyone in the area, whether it is helping with archery, getting people into armor, just being a hardworking and gentle person. I thought you deserved to be a lord of my court before you leave on the phone. So I wanted to do this for you. Thank you. Where did you get that? Yep, season. Whereas by the report and testimony of our counselors and by our own knowledge, we are plainly advised and informed that you, John David O'Draken, have pursued good works and deeds of virtue. Therefore, we are pleased to reward you with an award of arms. Ourselves and our heralds to determine unique and suitable arms done this day by our hands. <coughs> the drawing was by Andreas von Wolfsburg and Sonia to the um, illumination, and the calligraphy was by Katarina von Ravensburg, and a beautiful scroll, and I'm glad I got to give it to you. Thank you. His Majesty summons forth Ian the Modest. You're in trouble now. <laughs> Trying to sneak out the back. Oh, there we go. <laughs> 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 Not hard, fellas. It's okay. It's all right, brother. We just, we just want to make sure you got here safe. <laughs> You have always been a helpful, faithful member of the SCA. You have grown it. You have embraced it. You have helped everyone far and wide. And for that, I would like to grant you arms. We therefore <laughs> would grant him arms as registered with the College of Heralds, done this day by our hand. It's a gangster you. The illumination on this scroll was done by Lady Satara Al Katiba. Mm -hmm. I don't have a credit for the calligraphy, but it's a beautiful scroll. I'm glad you have it. Um, come find me if you need someone to get a date. Yeah. Thank you. I know you will. Thank you for everything you do. Minister of this event has business to, for your court. <coughs> there we go. I was caught in my chair.
competition um, was the populist choice. And I've got to tell you, in all of the um, daggers events I've been to, this was the biggest turnout of arts we've ever had. So y'all have got to, whether you want or not, you've got to keep up the good work. Um, would Finbar Bogason please come forward? <laughs> he produced a beautiful musical instrument, and um, I want one too because they're gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> you would think it's I couldn't play it like this. This is your scroll, mm. and it was illuminated and calligraphy by Siobhan Love. For our Laurel's choice, the winner was, excuse me if I pronounce this wrong because it's gay, but Slancha O'Haran. Slancha. a beautiful pin and pennant that she did the lost wax process and it's gorgeous when she's wearing it. <laughs> and this is her scroll. Also done illumination and calligraphy by Siobhan Love. <laughs> indicated to everyone here your involvement in the SCA is from the heart and you were always willing to help and always willing to teach for that I thought you needed to be a lady of our court and award you arms. Go uh, all men by these presents that we, Anna Maria Lina, Sovereign Council of the Rican, would reward service much. given to the kingdom by our well subject Hannah Glover with an award of arms. We further charge you to consult with our heralds to devise suitable arms. Done this Done this day by our hand. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, this scroll was lined and illuminated by Lady Rosina Fletcher. The calligraphy by Cat Cornwall. 
Thank you very much. <laughs> Which way you want to go? Your Majesty, there is news from the from the rapier lists this day. Would you have would you have that news? I would please. <laughs> please call the marshal. Nicholas, the marshal of the rapier field, please come forward. Nikoslav. Nikoslav. So we had 13 rapier fighters today, uh, and uh, ended up doing four tournaments. We had a speed tourney in the morning as a warm up. The second tourney was an Einvigi tourney, which is based off of a early Viking duel system. It was a open format doubly limb. The uh, winner of that is Marquette Hildebrand. He is he can come up. We have a prize for him. circle you lose so it was an interesting time of no one getting to back up that ended up being a 12 participant round robin the finals ended up we ended up doing a best of three single dagger buckler to go with the daggers and hemlock theme the winner of that was Davio de la Rouge he has Doti's prize his prize was this nice shield that he has donated He's holding the sword. No, he's not. He's a he doesn't know. He donated his prize to the winner of the bridesmaid tourney. There you go. Which is Nicholas Romero. <laughs> so he gets the original bridesmaid prize, which is a nice little box and a rabbit fur, and a Viking style rapier shield. Nice. Very cool. Well learned. <laughs> So was the bridesmaid tourney the last tournament of the day? Yes. So you were this close to not being a bridesmaid because you filed in the other tournament. Yes. He was very close. <laughs> he almost he almost could not fight in the tourney he planned to to win. <laughs> well done and well fought. Thank you. So yeah, thank you. Yes, please. His Majesty calls forth into the presence. Eris Harmonious. Observations and the kind words that I've heard about you teaching and sharing your knowledge, I thought you belonged in the Argent Rapier. So I'd like to give you a <laughs> Know all that there is harmonious, having shown prowess in the Argent Sword, is hereby named the Argent Rapier. Done this day by our hand. This was lined by Lady Mara Palmer and illuminated also by uh, Mara Palmer. Thank you very much. <coughs> Excuse me. Yes, please. Yes. 
His Majesty commands the, the presence of Jochi Naram. <laughs> Jochi, you are, and no one in this room doubts it, are a pillar of this community. There is so much that would have changed about the future of Radiators had you not come into the SCA. You shape it, you help grow, you get new guys in armor. You're just a great guy, all around. And it's since time you were branded arms. Because of this selflessness, giving of this gift, we, the crown, do grant you arms. Done this day by our hands. The calligraphy and illumination on this scroll was done by Isabella Du Bois. Thank you very much. <laughs> His Majesty invites Rebecca of Phoenix Glade to attend him. Bueller. Rebecca of Phoenix Glade. Does anyone know if she's here? Oh no. She's not here today. Okay. Thank you, Gunnar. Your Majesty, your event steward has news for your for your court.
His Majesty summons forth <clears throat> Carlos Blanco El Barbero. <laughs> Carlos, you look like a man who just came here from work. Uh, yes, I did. <laughs> well, I'm glad you made it because it is my honor to do this for you. And I want to tell everyone here <clears throat> that the role of a herald is a kind of a thankless job in a way. <clears throat> You're thanked by the people that you help, all the people that you do work for directly. But there is so much a herald does behind the scenes, a lot of hard work and time spent away from doing fun things that Carlos happily trades his time for. And for that, I want you to I want to introduce you to the order of the bow. The strength of a bow is in its drain, flowing through the xylem and flow to make wondrous patterns within the wood. So it is with our with our order of the bow, who add riches to our fair kingdom of Meridian. So do we monarchs of Meridian, named Carlos Blanco El Barbero, to, the order, to that order, come this day by our hands. century Icelandic Norse inspired scroll. Illumination was by Lady Satara and Mistress Grania did the calligraphy. Well learned. His Majesty calls forth Halvor Moose. <laughs> <laughs> Halvor, it's been an absolute pleasure getting to know you, um, and I have heard so much about your excitement for the SCA, you're a fanatic about everything Viking and helping people get into that sort of thing, and it's that kind of attitude that makes you worthy.